now we will take the array so click on this line and we will erase this line e enter and now select this line a r enter click on this polar array and now specify center point of the array click on this. hello guys today we will learn about this drawing so first we will read this drawing so let's start so first these are two circles first circle's value is radius 22 and second circle's value is radius 12.5 and this is a circle and this circle value is radius 38 and this is a circle from where this circle has been measured clear so this uh, circle's value is radius 92 and this is a circle whose value is radius 32 clear and this is a slot whose value is 13 and this is a part of this drawing whose value is 6 and this is an angle which is 60 degree and uh, this is a circle which value is 73 so let's start to make the drawing we will go to the autocad display this is a autocad display we will off the grid mode because we don't want the grid line we need to turn on four modes first dynamic input second ortho mode third snapping mode object snap tracking and fourth object snap we have to turn on this four mode to make the drawing so first we will make the circles so for circle we have to make multiple circles so for multiple circle m u l so we will click on this multiple option and now we have to enter the command so we have to use circle command so for circle c enter we have to click on anywhere so click here and uh, now we will give the value and uh, value is radius 22 enter and again click on this center point and we will give the value 12.5 enter and again click on this center point and now we will give the value 70 enter and again click on this center point and we will give the value 92 enter and again we will give the value 38 enter now we have to make these circles and now we will press the escape button and now to make this portion so we will use it so to make this portion we will use line and circle command so first we will use the line command l enter click on this quadrant point and now take a line from here to here clear and now we will take a offset o enter and offset distance will be 6.5 because complete distance is 13 so we will take a offset distance 6.5 so 6.5 enter click here and click the right side and click the left side now we will take the array so click on this line and we will erase this line e enter and now select this line and uh, a r enter click on this polar array and now specify center point of the array click on this center point and now we want to six items so six and enter and look here this circle is radius 32 so we will make the circle of radius 32 so for circle c enter click on this quadrant point and uh, will give the value 32 enter and now we have to make this portion this is a circle 2p circle so we will use the 2p circle so c enter 2 2p enter and uh, click on this point and click on this point c enter and 2p enter click on this point and click on this point and again i uh, will press the space bar and uh, 2p enter 
and click on this point and click on this point clear and now we'll trim it e or double enter and uh, like this we will trim it now we'll array this portion so for array a r enter and uh, select the portion the portion you want to array enter and click on this array type polar array and click on this center point and uh, we need to six items so six enter clear and now we'll trim it this way we trip this portion so for trim t r double enter and now we'll going to trim it And now we'll erase the circle. Click on this and E enter. Clear? And if we want to increase the line width, so for that we will click on this point and now we will turn on the show and hide toggle button. Clear? And select this drawing and click on this array and click 0 0.30. And now L enter. And click on this quadrant point and uh, now we'll take a line of 27.5 enter and now we'll take the offset look here to make this portion so we'll take offset 3 so O enter and offset distance will be 3 enter and click uh, right side and click left side clear and uh, we'll take a line from here to here then tr double enter and click on this circle clear so like this we have to make this drawing clear so thank you so much guys for watching my video